Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you are unable to install this update that is KB5068861 because of these error code on your Windows 11 computer. Now the first step is to pause and restart the update. So go to Windows update, hit pause over here. And once paused, now resume the updates and that should help you to install the update. Still not working. The next step is to start these services. Now for this, type in services in Windows search box and then click on services over here and then find app readiness make a double click set this to automatic click on apply click on start if highlighted and then click on ok make a right click on app readiness click on restart now find background intelligent transfer service make a double click set this to automatic click on apply click on start if highlighted Now make a right click on background intelligent and then click on restart. Now find windows update, scroll down here you can see windows update, make a double click on windows update, set this to automatic, click on apply, click on start if highlighted, then click on ok, make a right click on windows update, then click on restart. Now you can try to update your windows 11 and then check, still not working, the next step is to run this command so type in cmd in windows search box make a right click on command prompt app make sure that you run command prompt as an administrator only click on yes to allow now copy the first command paste it over here hit the enter key this will run a scan in my case i already ran a scan once the scan is 100 percent complete copy the second command paste it on the same window hit the enter key now once the second scan is 100 percent complete copy the third command paste it on the same window and once the third scan is 100% complete over here then restart your computer after the system restart you can check still not working use microsoft update catalog now for this you can open this link in a browser it will take you to microsoft website over here write down the name of the update that is kb5068861 click on search and then check the version so type in w-i-n-v-e-r in windows search box and then click on winver run command and you will see the version over here version 25h2 in my case it's version 25h2 now check the system type so go to windows settings system and then go to about option over here you can see 64 in my case it's 64 x64 based processor so for me it's windows 11 version 25h2 x64 based system now if you have windows 11 version 24h2 uh, x64 then this is the right one for windows 11 version 2 for h2 x64 for me this is the right one version 25 h2 x64 now click on download and over here click on kb5068861 and let the download complete once the download is complete you, you can click on this file follow the on-screen instruction and install this update manually and then restart your computer and after the system restart you can check still not working the next step is to use fix problems using windows update now for this open windows settings go to windows update click on advanced option over here scroll down click on recovery and here you can see fix problems using windows windows update this will reinstall your current version of windows your apps files and settings will be preserved so click on reinstall now this process will take some time and once this is done now restart your computer and then try to update now still not working the next step is to use media creation tool now for this you can open this link in a browser the link is provided in the video description scroll down here you can see media creation tool click on download now and then run this exe file now once you run this exe file you will see accept option click on accept over here by default windows 11 would be selected click on next select iso file over here and then click on next save it to desktop save now let the download complete this download will take some time once done click on finish option let this close automatically this will take couple of seconds or maybe a minute to close close it now once done go to desktop do not close this manually it will close automatically then go to desktop make a double click on windows iso file then make a double click on setup file run the setup file click on yes to allow click on next then click on accept over here and here you can see uh, the ready to install option uh, by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer so make sure this is checked and then hit install after the installation log into the computer and then try to update your windows 11 uh, so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to install this update successfully on your windows 11 computer so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel